I want to move on to US CDI version three. You added some new data elements, health status, procedure, health insurance, patient demographic, data classes. There's some interesting things in that. Is US CDI version three related to TEFCA in any way? Just so I, I, I don't jump topics here and confuse people. No, it is. A, yes. So the US CDI itself in general is related in that the requirement for, because one of the questions that, you know, that anyone might naturally ask in network is, well, what information gets shared? Like, is there a minimum requirement of what needs to be shared? Is there a maximum? Is there a flexibility? So what we said as a part of TEFCA, that the minimum that's required to be shared is, is the US CDI version one. So not the version three, but the version one. And the reason we did the version one is because that's what's um, required in certified EHR systems is the US CDI version one. And I can describe why you know, version two, version three, and how those fit into the picture. But we basically said that US CDI version one, that's that's the minimum expectation that everyone should have about the information they get. And the reason that we wanna do that is we wanna be able to say, how do we create a uniform floor across the country? So that regardless of where you are, you're in Southern California, you're in Nome, Alaska, you're in Athens, Georgia, that when you query the network, you should have the same expectation that at least I can get this amount of information. Maybe that's not everything you need and you have to figure out other ways to get the additional information, but everyone should have that basic service of, I should be able to get this minimally. So that's what the US CDI version one does. The version one, the reason we have version one, version two, version three is that- the, you're, you know, you're adding data elements, right? We're adding data elements, right? So every, every year, year and a half, we add more data elements and we do it, we try to be very judicious about that. And so we have a, a very public process where the public um, industry, federal agencies can submit their suggestions for additional data elements to add. 